up your money, pull up your tip, be quick. You ain't on going nowhere. Hi, my name is Jason from So The Land, and today we're just sharing with you our day. And if you stay till the end of the video, I'm gonna share with you guys a class I'm gonna be teaching. I'm teaching a class. A lot of the things that we share with you guys on our YouTube channel is just our story, our journey of just moving out east uh, 3,000 miles away uh, from where we're from in California and starting this life, starting this homestead life. And a big important part of that journey that we're on uh, is moving away from family because that is by far the hardest thing for us uh, by living way out here is being away from our family. But this week we have family visiting us and yesterday we went to pick them up at the airport. Woo! It's pouring out. Um, we're on our way to the airport. Yes! I'm so excited! We're gonna pick up my parents my parents both have not been here together since the year we moved out here, which was 2016. Yeah. And they came to visit us like shortly after we moved out here. And they, ha both of them together have not been back since. So my dad has not seen our property and all of the improvements that we've made. The last time he was here, it was just like a field of no. nothing. There yeah. was no garden. Well, they helped us get our first garden going when yes. we first moved. Oh, yeah. Um, and he planted our apple tree. I'm so excited. <laughs> you excited, Penelope? Oh, yeah! <laughs> what are you going to do when you see them, Penelope? Scream. You're going to scream? I'm getting so nervous. I don't know why. Hi, we're at the airport. She's talking to her sister. Uh, well, Penelope's like beyond excited. She barely slept last night. <laughs> <laughs> okay, they should be getting their luggage. Where are they, people? There they are. There they are, Penelope. We're in there. Yeah, we're in here. <laughs> Yay, we're... All right, we just got back at the house and I'm already putting Randy to work. Oh, <laughs> now that I got a second pair of hands, um, we're gonna try to finish off this pig shelter that I've been working on. Um, so whenever somebody comes visits us, especially family, I put them to work. <laughs> All right, so I need to put on some doors here and a door there. There should be six hinges in there. I was gonna put some tin on the bottom of this. Okay. So we gotta put some tin first and then we'll put that. Yeah, and then we'll put the, the hinges on. So you're just gonna put a piece in a section like this or is it wider? Or, or yeah, I think it's gonna come up to about here. Okay. Like this is the bottom part. Well, I'm gonna be adding wood chips. Okay. So the wood chips is going to initially go about that high, and then as oh, that's a lot of wood chips for them to, to stomp on, right? Yeah, and then as the months grow, I'm going to add wood chips. Right. And so it should be like almost that deep. Probably that deep. Yeah. This is bigger. We got to cut this. Yeah. Twice. <laughs> How you like that? <laughs> Actually, this is not bad. You kind of get, it's, you can tell I didn't cut straight. No, and that's fine. But I think it just takes some getting used to. It but, takes practice. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's kind of neat. <laughs> the only question I had when you were building this is why the screw so long? Yeah. Uh, yeah, I should have bought shorter screws. Yeah, maybe about like here. And I've been cutting them. Oh, have you? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> so I just haven't cut these ones, but I've been cutting them because yeah, this one's this one's cut. Okay. Eat it. It's so good. 
That kale, Penelope? Yeah. That smells good. Mm -hmm. Eat it. Yeah, okay. There's more in the garden if you want any. <laughs> Ooh, we're getting 120 degrees in this greenhouse. It's been an awesome week, actually, as far as the weather. It's been mid-60s for a whole week. Guys, I took off my long johns. <laughs> Bernice! I have some food, Bernice! Ducks, where are you? Whole Foods! Hey Bernice. Bernice, this is your grandma. <laughs> Bernice's grandma. Papa. She's beautiful. Yeah, she's a very beautiful bird. She knows it. She knows it. She knows it. <laughs> she knows it, huh? Now I need to get a Bernice t-shirt. <laughs> Bernice souvenir. <laughs> <laughs> Can't come to visit without a picture of Bernice. So it's pretty nice when family comes out to give me, or you know, help us out a little bit. And every time family comes out, they really enjoy their time here. Who wouldn't like their time here, right? You know, we're in the mountains, this is Asheville. I mean, the weather's super nice this week. Uh, who wouldn't like coming out? It's like a little mini vacation for our family. Where's Bernice at? But they're actually went into town right now while I get some work done in the shop. Um, but uh, yeah, we're happy to have them here. And uh, it's always a super special time with family. The hinges on this side. You know, I'm thinking the hinges, we're just gonna be put them just flat. Yeah, so they go up this way, right? Yep. To open it up all the way, you have to take that wood out, right? Yeah. Want to put it in. So, yeah, so maybe I'll put out that wood there. Yeah, I need something to secure it for sure. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> I mean, there's going to be wood chips in there, so you couldn't even push it in, anyways. Right, right, because of the weight. But yeah, I think it's. I think it looks good. What are you doing, Penelope? Pink colored. Whoa. Carrots too? Carrots, and I was testing to see if the radishes Radish. were ready, but they're not ready. They're too tiny. <laughs> well, we can eat this one. See our broccoli? Broccoli. It's growing. It looks so Look good. Okay, uh, cover, cover everything. Let's back up. Yeah. Help cover it, and we can open this and show Grandma what's under that one. Let's go see if we see Bernice. Sally Henny Penny, have you seen Bernice? <laughs> I don't know where she went. I don't see any any of the Bernices. Yeah, they're probably in the bush somewhere laying an egg. <laughs> I just got a package from the Organic Grower School in Asheville, North Carolina. I'll be teaching a class at the Organic Grower School Spring Conference in Mars Hill. North Carolina, which is not too far, just outside of Asheville, March 6th through 8th. This is the same class in the same school uh, that I taught last year. And it's gonna be uh, digital skills for the homesteader. Boom, right there. A wealth of knowledge here. All these people are gonna be speaking on farming, homesteading, permaculture, uh, raising livestock. And uh, this event is really catered towards uh, this area, but anybody can attend. It's at Mars Hill University. I will leave a link down in the show notes of their website so you can check out for yourself. And it's also the same class that I taught at the Homesteaders of America conference this, this last year. And I also have that class on our Patreon page. So if you wanna sign up for our Patreon page, you have that full class on there. I will also be filming at the event, just filming my day, and we'll be sharing with you guys uh, what this event is all about. But it's super awesome to have family here this week uh, to help us out a little bit, hang out, catch up, uh, have some good meals, good food together. And uh, I appreciate you guys watching. My name is Jason from Sow the Land, and we'll see you guys next time. 
All right, I see Bernice over there. There she is. Bernice! Where have you been, Bernice? You too, Bernice. Where have you guys been? Come here. It's all right. You know, all the chickens are getting ready for bed. You too, ducks? You getting ready for bed? 